What's up guys, this is Trey with Smart Home Starter and today I wanted to do a quick video on uh, Ring Doorbell or really any Ring product. And what we're gonna do today is actually add a second device to our already existing Ring system. So if you need to invite somebody uh, to have access to your Ring Doorbell or really any Ring product, we're gonna walk through how to do that step-by-step. -step. Now, uh, we do have a full article on this uh, at smarthomestarter.com. I will drop the description below, full screenshots, arrows, uh, basically walking through the same process that I'm about to do today. So. To kick things off, what we need is basically the admin account or the account with all the permissions. Uh, from here, what we need to do, or what that person needs to do, is open the app, pretty straightforward, and we're going to find here um, the settings, right? So we'll select that, and uh, go down to the bottom, and we'll select shared access. So here we have Trey Jacobs, that's me, it's so funny, I spelled my name wrong. Why? I don't know, but it's that way. So <laughs> uh, at the bottom of the screen, we'll select add user or pet. Let me straight forward. And we're going to add a shared user. Now here, this screen, we're going to add our email address for whoever we are inviting. So whoever we're inviting to the Ring account, we wanna make sure that their email address is input here. And we're going to select the devices that we wanna grant this user access to. So I'm just going to select all of my devices. I have a couple more that I need to install, uh, but we'll send invite. And that is that. So you'll see here the status is now invited. So if they don't have a ring account, we'll just walk through the process really quickly here of setting that up. So I'm going to start this process from an email. I'll select creating an account. We can also do this from the login screen at the ring app. We'll put in our first name, our last name, our country. We'll put in our email. We'll retype our email and then, then do the same thing with the password. And then we should get an email to verify an account. We'll verify the email and then we'll set up our two step verification. And it'll send us a text and we should be good. All right. So now that they have a ring account, pretty simple. We need to sign into that ring account. So we'll go to here. All right, so what you'll see here is, well, there's nothing there. Well, what's because we haven't actually accepted the invite. So what we got to do is actually go back to the email that we received from Ring, letting us know that somebody invited us to this Ring ecosystem. And from here, we're just going to select Manage Access and um, hit this Manage button, and then we'll accept. So we now have officially accepted the invite to manage the ring devices that we set up on this main account. Now to show you, uh, let's open up the ring app one more time, the ring app, boom. And now you'll see that we have access to these cameras. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I hope this was helpful for you. Remember, check the description if you want to see the written version, pictures, arrows, all that fun stuff. If this was helpful for you, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, drop a comment below, and we'll see you next time, guys. See ya.